I'm going to finish talking about my this hate towards Elaine because right now, yo, this bitch is tired. I'm really like sleepy at the moment. And so it's just, I, I had to be nosy and look up that she does come back to life. And I just saw the episode about King and Deanne. It's just so ridiculous. It's just, this is why you don't make immortal characters look like children. Because it excuses a lot of things. And then, I get that Deanne was a giant, but she was still a child. And I get that he had amnesia, but still. This whole lolly thing, immortal thing, it's just not... Like, I already don't like Meliodas. King was already, like, I was, like, already not liking him. But then he never touched Deanne, so I'm like, okay, that's fine. But he saw her as a kid. He didn't watch her grow up, but still, the fact that he remembers how she was as a kid, as how she was as a kid, I'm sorry, and finds her sexually attractive now... Mm -mm. You watched her grow up. You saw her hit pew. Like, you basically just seen the glow up. Like, mm -hmm. Bon, like, uh, that's why I don't hate Bon. He sees Elaine as a woman. But that's why Bon isn't a, high on my list. Gila is a. Gila and Hawk and Gother right now are only characters I fuck with. Until I meet up, meet with Merlin. I know, I know about the show. I'm just, that's why I don't want to watch it. My brother wanted me to watch it. And I see, no. The story's good. Like, shows like Seven Deadly Sins piss me off because they have so much more potential. It's, it's just like, why are you the way that you are? You know how to do all this fan service bullshit. This is why I don't watch anime anymore because of that. I stick to shows like Death Note and Tag on Titan because they hardly have any fan service. They really don't. I stick to the manga version though of America, um, <laughs> Tag on Titan because I think it's a bit better. <laughs> I'm trying to like it. I really am, but I don't. I hate, I hate Meliodas. It's already bad because he's the main character and I hate him. I'm not even joking, I hate Meliodas. The only thing keep me going is his VA. Mm. I loved, I loved watching this ass get beat when he was in his demon form. Quote, quote, demon form, whatever. I was... <laughs> oh my god, they're the only two people. Vaughn's still mad as excuse. The reason I don't like Hauser because he only likes the idea of Elaine. He's only known her t two days. Here he has a big old crush on her. <laughs> I just. I don't like anime. It was. I think his Death Note set the standard of how to do anime well without doing being. Are they fan service -y? I really don't. That's that's why video games now, I, I'm fucking with them again. Because at least they're equal. I feel more equal. So that anime really is not... It's not for me. Not anymore. The only other show that I like is My Hero Academia. And yet... It's almost good, but Momo's outfit's really questionable. Like, I get It's the same thing like Quiet from Metal Gear Solid. Like, if you're gonna do that, make your female characters like that, why, can't you, why couldn't it be a male character? Hmm? Like, the whole thing, problem with Fire Emblem, when the girl with the boob 
armor. And I was like, what about Vake? But yeah, Vake wasn't like going all like his pictorials. This girl was literally having her hands drawn on her boobs and like emphasizing the boobs. Well, he was all like, whoo, I was macho. I'm like, y'all, there's so much potential that anime could be. But literally, it gets, it's stuff like that is what gives, keeps it from getting more attention. And that's why you don't, they don't get the big monies. Except from people jacking off to it. The hentai, <laughs> millennials are on the hentai industry. <laughs> I can't. The only, thing, the only thing I'm addicted to right now is Dragon Age. And The Magicians is a good show, too. You want a while of Magicians? Because it has really good representation. And the women are badass. And the men are also badasses. It's just... I feel like anime... Most anime have a lot of catching up to do. If they want to get bigger. I mean, it's already big, but it could be it could be way bigger. Trust me. Like I was watching um, think of Digi Bros video about anime dubs could be better, and I could see it. But if they could stop doing fan service and all, for both men and women, or people that are attracted to, or they're attracted to, if they like do like Studio Shibli and those kind of animes and just focus on story rather than spectacle. And style. Maybe they could get the big VAs like Mark Hamill. And. I we got so much in Mark Hamill. There's more. I have. There's, I know there's more VAs. Or like big profile. Like Kari Payton. We already got Phil Lamar doing all that good shit. Like we got, like there's so much, man. There's just... Steven Yun. Like, come on. You have all those talented VA, like actors that are really good at also voice acting. But obviously, they're gonna want the big money. But who's gonna pay the big money when Nala Studios, like besides Disney, want to dub anime to give it to the West? It's just ridiculous. That's the thing I hate. Like, just so much potential being wasted. And then we wonder why good shows get canceled, though, when they're not given their attention. <clears throat> Firefly. <clears throat> but that's an old thing. And then Community was going to do well, but then look at that. That, that potential that we're going to. I feel like I'm just going to tell this all about potentials and all that. I just, like, there's been a lot of things disappointing me lately. A lot of my shows and stuff have been disappointing me. So far, there's, like, very few things that haven't disappointed me. Even, like, I'm not even looking forward to Captain Marvel, to be honest. I don't, it's not interesting to me. It's not, and I don't want to compare to Shazam, but Shazam looks fun. I, like, I'm invested. From the first trailer I saw, I'm invested. And the first trailer for Captain Marvel, like, I, everyone was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm just, mm, mm, eh, eh, no. It's, I'll just go stick to Shazam and Endgame. Endgame looks exciting, though. I mean, obviously, it has to, it got the clout from Affinity War. I, f I like doing videos like these, because I have next things to talk about next. For the next video, you know, <laughs> for the next, next, next. I should start making scripts, but you know what? That ain't me. I like to rant, or at least I get my thoughts out. It's healthy, cause you know you don't have all this shit in your head. Ain't that wonderful? I'm gonna stop right here, because I'm probably gonna pray shows like magicians and. Show and the games that I've been replaying recently, which is Dragon Age Inquisition. Well, not like replaying it, but get it back into it. And oof.
Oh, I can't wait to talk about those too. So, peace out, bitches. I'm going to...